One thing about me is that I'm originally from uh, Libya, uh, specifically the city of Benghazi, uh, which usually gets a standing ovation. Uh, yeah, thank you. Uh, I've lived in the States for, uh, for five years now, and I think I need to speak to a manager. <laughs> yeah, what's your return policy? Because uh, the product looks nothing like the image. <laughs> I even read the reviews before moving here, you know? And I was like, wow, 50 stars sounds amazing. Yeah, <laughs> that's great. I also moved to a new place, I have a new roommate, his name is Gion. I don't know if you guys are familiar with the name Gion or not, I haven't heard it myself, so I asked him, like, oh, Gion, what a cool name. What does that mean? And he said, oh, Gion. Gion is an Italian name that translates to, God is great. I was like, oh, cool, what a flex, okay. Uh, <laughs> but I felt kind of jealous, because I know if I ever have a kid, I can't name him. God is great in Arabic. <laughs> yeah, because that won't fly. Uh, like, like, that literally won't fly anywhere. Uh, The other day I got into this Uber and the driver did the thing where he wanted to uh, match uh, the name he sees on the screen with how I pronounce my name. So he asked me, oh, how do you pronounce this? I was like, oh, it's Mohanit. And he was like, huh. Uh, you know, actually, here in the States, it's pronounced Mohammed. <laughs> I was like, oh, cool, okay. Uh, well, that's a great point. Uh, it's just not how names work. <laughs> Yeah, they don't change based on location. <laughs> you know, because if your name is Miles and you travel and you go to France, uh, no one is gonna come to you and be like, hmm, actually here, it's pronounced kilometers, yeah. <laughs> it stays the same. Uh, we, uh, we live in a sad times right now, because uh, I don't know if you know this, I've, I've saw it in the news the other day, but in the year of 2018 only, over 700 people uh, were shot by the police here in the US. Now, do you know how many people were shot by the police in Libya, which is a third world country, in 2018? No one, absolutely zero. Now, some people will argue that's because Libya has no police, which is true. Uh, <laughs> But it's beside the point. Uh, yeah, it is less the police and more like uh, where the is the police. <laughs> like, uh, speaking of boy bands, I hate them. Uh, I don't like them, I think they suck, sorry. Uh, I'll tell you the three boy bands that I hate, starting by the ones I hate the most. Uh, so it's the, uh, it's the Jonas Brothers, uh, uh, One Direction, and uh, ISIS. <laughs> yeah, I don't like their work. Any ISIS fans here? Okay. Uh, I don't like them. I know some of you are like, hey, buddy, I think one of these groups is so different from the two others. <laughs> yeah, I know, I'm not stupid. Uh, <laughs> One Direction was not America's mistake. Uh, yeah. Thank you, very smart. Uh, and, you, and here's the thing, if you think, if you think you hate ISIS, imagine being that group uh, uh, Al-Qaeda. Yeah, remember those? Yeah, they used to be big on YouTube. Uh, yeah, only the 90s kids can relate. I get it. Because uh, Al-Qaeda is probably somewhere now in a cave, just watching ISIS just thrive on TV and do their thing. And they're there just being like, ah, stupid millennials. <laughs> their fancy cameras just ruining everything. <laughs> Anyway, my name is Mohan El Sheikh. That's my time, everyone. Thank you so much.
Thank you.